welcome back. Today we are partnering up with Alaska Seafood to bring you this delicious sticky salmon bowl. Now before you rush off and make this just do me a favour when you go and buy ingredients buy double because I promise you are going to want leftovers for tomorrow. Just trust me. Just trust me on this. To make your sticky teriyaki sauce, take a small pan and add some soy sauce, brown sugar, honey, garlic and chilli flakes. Bring to a simmer and cook gently for four or five minutes or until the sauce gets rich and glossy. In a small bowl mix together the corn flour and cold water, then pour this into the sauce. Mix well and add in the rice wine vinegar. Place the salmon fillets into a baking dish lined with foil. Pour over the teriyaki sauce and place the ribbons of spring onion on top. Fold the foil over to create a little tent over the salmon and bake. When choosing salmon, I urge you to source wild and not farmed salmon. Wild Alaska salmon gets its deep, vibrant colour from eating a 100% natural diet and living a life in the icy, open waters of the Pacific Ocean. No colourings, dyes or preservatives needed. Now to make my bowl, I added hot rice, ribbons of heritage carrots, my sticky teriyaki salmon, avocado and edamame beans. Then I finished off with a sprinkle of poppy seeds. So huge thanks to Alaska Seafood for inspiring my delicious lunch. As always, pop down to the description box below where you can find the full written recipe and I'm going to catch up with you guys in the next video. Over and out.